So guys, I created some bleachy um, wipes out of some old t-shirts that I have in here. And I'm going to be doing a grocery haul, but I'm going to be wiping everything down, which is crazy because I told y'all how I wiped stuff down almost two something weeks ago. But one of you, which is TP, sent me a video of a doctor showing how, you can just leave right there, babe, how he wiped everything down. So I'm going to be wiping stuff down and then putting it up here. And if you want to see how I made these or what's inside, it's real simple. Most people have this in their house. Look in the link below. But now I'm getting ready to get this stuff up off the floor. And one by one, wipe off what I can and put it up here. Because some stuff can't be open, but some stuff um, just need to be wiped down because of the outside. And I'm not wearing gloves. Why? Because all I got to do is wash my hands. So it's not that serious. So yeah, some stuff I'm just going to get rid of. And I'm going to show you all the stuff I got rid of. So we also got strawberry ice cream, mint chocolate chip, and vanilla bean. And I'm going to put these in the freezer so that we don't sit here too long as I wipe this off. A lot of stuff is sitting here. I don't want it to melt. So let me put those in the refrigerator. But that is a part of our haul as well. All right, guys. So I'm not going to bore you guys with the wiping off of things. So I'm going to show you. I'm on my second one. The other one is down here. And we still have a lot. Mind you, he shopped for us not to have to leave for a few weeks hopefully it'll get better and things will start coming back to normal before then but yeah so i'm going to continue wiping stuff down and then um i'm gonna do the haul so this is everything that's been wiped down so far okay but still got a lot so yeah let me continue wiping y'all we're not even going to talk about this Yes, he had to get one of these from Dollar Tree. I'm so scared. Like, I had to throw this in here because I just opened this up. But, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to wait a couple more days or just do it today. But, yeah. He had to pick this up because I'm late, 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 late. And I'm an older woman, so it's scary. So, yeah. We shall see. All right, y'all. OMG, when I tell y'all this took a minute to literally wipe all this stuff down, but it's worth it. We're not going nowhere no time soon, and that's why he said just get as much as we can now. So, let's start from this end over here, and what we have is a mixture of Sam's, Audi's, Dollar Tree, Save a Lot. I think that's it. Sam's, all these Dollar Tree, save a lot. Walmart. So it's a mixture. Some of you can recognize the Walmart stuff, the Sam's stuff, Dollar Tree, and all that good stuff. So we're going to start from here. We have some Sargento Shark Cheddar and some Age White. Yes, they had it. We've been looking for this and we couldn't, been, couldn't find it. We have these, my favorites. These and white chocolate um, Kit Kats are my fave. We found, well, he found um, pan pizza, um, crispy pan pizza. Never had that one before. And that is from Sam's. We have sour cream from Aldi's, Hillshire Farm turkey breast and honey ham from Walmart, Rocky Road trail mix from Walmart. That's, I think, Naya's favorite. Some rippled potato chips from Walmart, some mango nectar, some lemon juice, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree some cheddar cheese from all these three blocks of that some home style spread um from all these we have some hickory brown sugar i want to say that's um from all these and that's like the equivalent to sweet baby rays this is so good guys you got to try it we have some natural chicken wings from purdue back there some wing sections we have the white chocolate snack size assortment mix this is my fave. That's Husby's, Hubby's fave, and that's Rizzy's fave, and we all eat all of them, except for Rizzy. Rizzy don't eat the peanut butter one. Yeah, I know I've been baking like crazy. So I have two brown sugars, two powdered sugars, 
We have jasmine rice. He didn't realize that he forgot it until he got to Walmart, but they had it at Walmart because I've been eating the one from Audis. And yeah, this one is one that we're trying. I'll let you know how that is because I never had their, their jasmine rice. I always have that in my crab legs. I actually did good with these. I ate these three times um, last time I bought them and it lasted me throughout the month because I only take like a cluster and I mix it with other stuff. I mixed it with like other seafood or whatever. So, um, yeah, I was able to stretch that and stretch these. We still still no colossal um, shrimp. So we just got large. We have some hash brown from Audi's, some tortillas. You know, we got to have our tacos from Audi's. And we got the seasoning package. Some of the stuff is still wet from me wiping it down. When I say oh, we wiped everything down, we wiped everything down front, back, side, all over. Um, so we got two packs of taco seasonings, cookies. These are always the go-to when mommy don't feel like baking because they used to having baked goods in the house. Slim Jims, which is Rizzy's favorite, but everybody eats these. We have fish sticks, which always comes in handy when you don't want to cook. And these are my husband's favorite sausage and my mom's favorite sausage. So we got that from Sam's, 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 Sam's for these kielbasa. We got some great meals coming up with those. And you get five, four of them for like four something. It's just a better deal because, no, for five something. I think six dollars, which is still cheaper because these are like two something for one. So it's better to buy them in bulk. Sugar, y'all know we need that. Yeah, our raw sugar we haven't been able to find so we went back to the trusted old regular pure cane sugar so we got two of those some flour we got some that's all from Audis. this from Audis as well i like to eat my um tuna fish with aged cheddar on it with those so bomb then moving forward we have hubby gets in his fat his phase where he want kool-aid so ooh. so he got kool-aid and these are the ones that he got. Black cherry, watermelon. What's your favorite Kool-Aid? Have you ever drunk, drunk Kool-Aid? What was your favorite? You know which one was my one of my favorites? I love blue raspberry. That's like my favorite favorite. Um, but what was it? Um, the watermelon, I think it was, invisible. That was really good. So I have these four tacos. They didn't have the big jars, my, hus my husband said. They just had small ones, so we got those. We got our butter, because you know I'm always baking. Mayo, because we're low on that. All these, all these, great value, great value. I mean, Walmart, all these. They didn't have the honey sweet top wheat, so we had to get that. And then we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of these pizzas, which are bomb. We like to put like garlic, onion powder, and pepper on them and then bake them. So good. So good. So that's what we got there. Moving along from Dollar Tree, we have those elbows and penne pasta. I want to say the Jiffy came from Walmart, right, babe? Jiffy from Walmart. Audis. Okay, from Audis. And then we have the cheesy beef patties. Those came from Save a Lot. Which I wish Sam's would start save, um, selling the cheesy ones. They only have spicy and regular. But the cheesy ones are so bomb. Had to have our... Oh, you only got beef this time, babe? Noodles. Okay, they ain't have chicken. So we got beef ramen. And then two of these freezer pops. These aren't the ones with the rebates. These are just the regular ones, but we got two of those. My almond milk and the hubby and the kids almond milk, but they will use mine if they need it for certain stuff if that is out. And then over here, he has some grape juice. This grape juice is so good. The cranberry juice. All of these 100% juices from um, Aldi's are the bomb. Canola oil, I want to say that's from Aldi's as well. Some lemon cookies, these are my faves, one of my faves, but I also love the vanilla. I'm just greedy. I like sweet, y'all. I just like sweets. <laughs> um, but hubby likes the vanilla better than the lemon. Um, so Dollar Tree. Moving over ground beef, Audis. Yeah, they only had one. Okay. Um, ground beef from Audis. Italian sausage, hot, hot links. Um, those are from Audis, I believe. Chicken is from Sam's. He went to look for turkey wings because I wanted to do turkey wings with gravy and rice and all that. 
but they didn't have the turkey wings but they did have my smoked turkey for my pinto beans that i want to throw in a crock pot you can't go wrong with some pinto beans in a crock pot with some rice and some cornbread and then we got some bacon some hickory bacon from sam's this bacon is so bomb they didn't have the big um case of capri suns like we usually get so you got these from walmart Audi had them price right okay so he got these from price right how much were they babe okay that's not bad mm-hmm so he said these was three for five he got two wild cherry wild cherry is my favorite and then fruit punch and then from all the i mean walmart the kettle chips i love these and i love the ones that Audi has they're both the bomb they had not so yeah we got the kettle kettle jalapeno um flavored chips the bomb love them and this family loves cream of wheat so we are out of cream of wheat and so we got that as you can see my little cream of wheat thing is low so we got that and then we got two orange juices you hear me orange juices apple juice i'm looking at the orange juice saying apple saying orange to the apple two apple juice and oh they only let you get two pregos prego the sauce i only see two babe you must have left something in the car because i think i put three babe so we got two pregos now we have our meals i'm gonna tell you the meals that we plan on making but one of them is it only the turkey wings that you want you only get two okay Mm -hmm. Oh, he said that they are limiting things so people can't just be greedy and taking it from other people, which I like that. I, I do. Um, he's saying like, if you was to get this chicken, you can only get one because it's a big, you know, family pack. And if you wanted other chicken, it would have to be like a thigh or a wing, but only one of something different but you couldn't come and get like multiples of these so that's what sam's was doing okay and he was saying they limited these at walmart you only could get like two who Audi. all is limiting two so you can get two of something so where you get those pizzas from oh not nice stuff so basically like essential stuff breads and flowers milk okay Okay, that's why he was only able to... Okay, got it. Bread, dairies, meat, stuff like that. Okay, got you. Okay, so then he has my vanilla creamer. I love that. That's my favorite. If you like creamer and you're spending more money, try this. I promise you, you will love it. I don't put nothing in my coffee or um, my tea. If I want tea, usually it's coffee, but I've been trying to do better by drinking tea. Um that right there is it all you need and sometimes if i want to spruce it up i spray some of the um the whipped cream on top of it okay then we got the free pope orange juices all these and two buttermilk ranch we live for ranch in this house we got to have ranch on deck then um one of our meals is pink salmon um croquettes with grits so that's why we got those it's cheaper for now to get those than the fresh ones because they don't lower their bags to like three or four pieces and that's not gonna do us no justice because i literally what the filling that i put in here i usually could try to get us each two at least for dinner and i wasn't doing it with a bag and i'm basically paying four dollars for one bag and if i have to do it with two that's eight dollars when these are like two something were they two something babe the salmon i know they under three dollars i believe they under three dollars so that's cheaper so then these are the pinto beans you can't go wrong with having beans so i got my pinto beans on deck because i will be putting some of them in the crock pot then we have some angel here because we plan on doing some spaghetti then i have my whip topping because i just like to have that in there for just in case i don't know and then we got some french onion dip which that's hubby favorite for chips and stuff like that so now moving over here we have the can of pinto beans that fell on the ground then we have they love these Ugh. manchos they didn't have snaps babe 
They love the munchos, so bunchies. Okay, cool, cool. Okay, so they like these better. Ginger ale, we got one. Oh, these are from Sam's. This is a ginger ale from Audi's. We got another one near y'all. know I love, love, love ginger ale. Hubby wanted Fago, so he got some Fagos, and it has red um, pop, uh, lemon, lime, orange, and then grape. Can't go wrong with Fagos. Those are old school sodas. Then we got some rustic potatoes. I want to say Fagos is from Sam's. Potatoes from where, babe? Audi's. And we found out this was a better buy because of the amount. I want to say this 10 pounds. Yep. And the 10 pound bag was like eight something at uh, Sam's. But when we get the 10 pound bag here, um, it's five something, ain't it? $3.99. So it's a bigger, better deal. And then we always like to have this on deck because we use this for washing um, clothing, cleaning around the house and all that good stuff. And you can't beat this 15 pound bag of Arm & Hammer, y'all. You cannot beat this. Guess what? It is only like six bucks, five and some change. Then he wanted some Doritos. So he got the 50 pack of Doritos. And um, yeah, that's for snacks and stuff like that. Have you ever had Doritos with French onion, babe? Is it good? I was thinking about that. So, yeah, guys, that is my haul. And so let me get my list real quick um, so I can share with you guys some of the meals that I'm going to be creating um, for the next two weeks. So we got 10 meals and the weekends are kind of be, you know, fin for yourself. And it depends on how I feel because I do cook on the weekend sometimes. But what I'll probably do is just switch it up for days I don't feel like cooking. We just push that meal like I told you guys when I showed you all my meal plan and some years ago. Um, how I do I probably do a more updated one um, but for right now I'm going to share with y'all what I actually am going to be making for my family in these next couple weeks hold on okay so the meals that I will be creating we having fish and for oh they didn't have fish did they okay so we're not sure about the fish he didn't go to the one store pencil beans and rice turkey wings we got an x nay on that because he couldn't find those spaghetti goulash salmon and grits burgers and fries breakfast and then something with chicken wings but now that we have more kibasi i can always do some type of meal with kibasis and penne pasta or something it, we could still make it work if we can't find the turkey or the fish i can still you know make it work it's not that serious it ain't like we ain't, can't never have it again but that was the plan it was supposed to be fish fries Fish and fries, pinto beans and rice with cornbread, turkey rings, rice, a vegetable, like with turkey wings and gravy, rice, a vegetable, and um, cornbread, spaghetti and garlic bread, goulash and garlic bread, tacos, um, salmon and grits, burgers and fries, breakfast and chicken wings, and some type of side and rice or pasta or something. I don't know for sure. But that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know this was a little bit longer, but I wanted to share actually how we bring our food in during this time and sanitize it um, before we let our kids touch it or anybody get into the food. This is what I do. So thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, leave them below and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Later Gators. Oh, y'all like to see this, so I'm just going to kind of do a before and after before we put everything away. This is kind of what things look like for now. All the empty stuff. <laughs> All the, well, this is empty. We got to fill that. The flour is low. The brown sugar is low. All that stuff will be refilled. The refrigerator is low. So, yeah, I'm going to just go through and show you the stuff once we put this stuff away. So, see you in a little bit. All right, guys, so this is all the trash that needs to go to recycling bin. Oh, and those are the wipes I use to wipe everything down. This is this cabinet. Those baskets are full of chips and stuff. This is the refrigerator. And we didn't get to get no fruit. They didn't have much, so that's that. Let's see everything in there. Um, yeah, and then this is the freezer. So, and I am eating oh, the butter. We put butter in here. We had a um, little bit of spam left, so I'm making that. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these bean sprouts. I don't want to waste them. We have some yellow rice still. So yeah, all of these things been filled. 
the um we got more pasta but it's angel here that's regular spaghetti so i'm gonna just leave that in the little pantry canola oil extra virgin olive oil cream of wheat sugar butter was also refilled and all of this stuff back here was refilled the pancake mix the brown sugar we already had rice but we still have some down there the powdered sugar and the elbows were refilled beans were put up here kool-aid the cornmeal mayo the sauce some prego the taco thingies what else was put up here um taco sauce back there and i think that was about it for this cabinet so in my little pantry little area i put the ranch the extra ramen the crackers the angel here then i put the elbows and pina right there pinto beans all in here and guys i had a whole bag of pinto beans and that's what i get for not looking so all the rice and stuff is right there then there's cornmeal flour and um grits in there and then all the sugars are there the chicken and the beef ramen noodles um, we didn't get any more cereal we don't eat cereal like that but we do like cereal but we just it just lasts too long but those are her nut cereals and free pebbles um the actual regular brand and then this is where i put my oils and sauces and stuff and juices and stuff so yeah that is it and the potatoes were filled so that is that guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video all right guys so this was all the trash that needs to go to recycling bin oh and those are the wipes i use to wipe everything down this is this cabinet those baskets are full of chips and stuff this is the refrigerator and we didn't get to get no fruit they didn't have much so that's that let's see everything in here um yeah and then this is the freezer so and i am eat oh and the butter we put butter in here we had a um little bit of spam left so i'm making that I don't know what I'm going to do with these beans pots. I don't want to waste them. We have some yellow rice still. So, yeah. All of these things been filled. The um, We got more pasta, but it's angel here. That's regular spaghetti, so I'm going to just leave that in the little pantry. Canola oil, extra virgin olive oil, cream of wheat, sugar, butter was also refilled. And all of this stuff back here was refilled. The pancake mix, the brown sugar. We already had rice, but we still have some down there. The powdered sugar and the elbows were refilled beans were put up here kool-aid the cornmeal mayo the sauce some prego the taco thingies what else was put up here um taco sauce back there and i think that was about it for this cabinet so in my little pantry little area i put the ranch the extra ramen the crackers the angel here then i put the elbows and pina right there Pinto beans all in here and guys I had a whole bag of pinto beans and that's what I get for not looking so all the rice and stuff is right there then there's cornmeal flour and um, grits in there and then all the sugars are there the chicken and the beef ramen noodles um, we didn't get any more cereal we don't eat cereal like that but we do like cereal but we just it just lasts too long but those are her nut cereals and free pebbles um, the actual regular brand and then this is where I put my oils and sauces and stuff and juices and stuff. So yeah, that is it. And the potatoes were filled. So that is that guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video.